story basically I need to relax my hair before I get braids this week I'm hoping the red doesn't come out I'm thinking red is my color like next time I shake my braids out and let my hair take a break I'm gonna do red again because like it's so pretty especially in the sun but yeah I'm gonna relax my hair my mom's gonna do it because I don't know when again I'm gonna relax my hair I think we'll be only again in November because I think I only did twice last year. Beginning of the year and November. But yeah, let's go relax there. I came to get gloves in the car. But this is before. My hair doesn't really look great right now. This is like part one of doing my hair. Part two, we braiding my hair. It does have a tub. Mm -hmm. Activator. I've never seen an activator like this. Why does it kind of feel like it's open? Instructions. Here, may I Cream moisturizer. There's a shampoo. Mm. Shampoo. Hey, it's this thing. <laughs> this is what making the mess. It was there were crystals on my own pants. So I just know the way they're coming from. This is the hair now. I'm gonna go wash my hair. She's burning in like odd locations, but like some places she kind of looks pink. Yeah. I'm gonna wash my hair now. And then I need to treat it and then blow dry. Okay, so I'm done blow drying my hair. You can't really tell, but the color. In the hair dye definitely stayed in my hair. You see, and my hair has definitely grown longer, but my ends are kind of drag a bit. The rest of my hair, but that's most likely because when I don't know, whenever I put treatment in, I always start at the roots and then go to the end, even though I blow dry my roots and my ends. But yeah, they'll get better as I put lotion in my hair and stuff but yeah my hair is quite long now but that is part one of my hair transformation like my hair is definitely gone longer it's like a little shutting basically but the lights are not off yet so I'm brushing this clip to Lou see you again when I bring my hair now my hair definitely looks better, like especially the ends, because my mom came to help me. Look at my hair. But I mean that to you without my mother. Like when I do my hair, it does not look this good. But yeah. Today is the 18th of January. Results come out tomorrow. I'm currently watching come live with me. It's so loud. And I'm currently filling in this like roommate questionnaire for the res I'll be staying at it's kind of due tomorrow but I want to hand it in today but like some of these questions I don't know how to like answer them like how much do you they want like one question is do you have any specific requests regarding roommates and I'm like I don't think so because like I want a roommate with like, someone I can vibe with like we don't have to necessarily be friends 
as long as we get along and i feel like it would be nice to have someone with similar interests you know because we have something to talk about like someone with similar interests somebody who maybe does the same degree as me you know but yeah i need to get rid of this pimple sunlight i'll film again once i'm doing like a get ready of me to prep my skin for tomorrow because we're going to my school to fetch my results just kind of from the okay. Also, I also need to edit two videos. But yeah. From the table. So for my mains, I'm serving the fish. Uh, everything is good to go. He plates and his main is ready. A taste of Southeastern. Welcome the Minister of Basic Education, Umer no, no, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Program director. Sorry, I'm eating Indomie noodles with cheese right now. There is me. Then I'm going to do my skincare. It looks like it needs to look good for tomorrow. Um, come back when I'm doing my skincare to show you guys what I'm doing and if this is the update to my routine. Okay, so we're in the bathroom. It's currently 11 p.m. Um, first things first, before I done the play in my face, because I haven't done it in a little bit over the month, I'm going to wash my face with this face wash. This face wash over here. This is like my holy grail, basically. I love this face wash, it works so well. But yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. And then I'm gonna double cleanse, then demo plain using this tissue oil. But yeah, let me wash my face. <laughs> also, I didn't mention I popped a pimple. So, like, this, I popped a pimple on my face right now. Because I popped a pimple out of nowhere, even though, like, Last night I did my skincare and everything. So I'm like, why are you gonna do that to me, skin? Whatever. I'm always cool when you do this with the soap to make it all bubbly. I did this for 30 seconds and then I rub onto my face for 60 seconds and then wash it off and then I do it again. But I haven't been counting so I'm not to assume that was 30 seconds. Okay, time to dermaplane. I'm not gonna do this on camera because next thing I cut my eyebrows off and then I will cry. I will do that. But I'll be back looking fresh faced and clean. Okay, so I'm right about done dermaplaning. Now I'm doing my eyebrows. I need to shave them and little cut the, the long hairs. But first, we gotta stop looking like glazed donuts. And I think I'm just gonna wash this off my face. Okay, so our girl is done with her brows. She put them. If you cannot tell the difference, it doesn't matter. Because I can. They just look more clean, you know? They're not exactly this. They're not, they're not twins. But they're sisters. Maybe cousins, you know? But I do. I'm gonna do like a makeshift, um facial type of thing i'm gonna put some toner pads on my face and leave them there for a while i'm gonna soak some cotton pads with toner that's my method because i don't really have like toner pads so are like in toner 24 7. hello everybody it's the next day after i got my hair done i said i need to show you another look this is a close-up This time it's very long, I'm like, and I haven't done the high school. Yeah. She's long. I will probably keep these in until March, like when I come back home for the Easter break. I would like to say yesterday, after some point, because I cut my hair down for like 10 hours almost, basically, I had 
lost my energy to socialize at that point. And by the end, my head was like pulsing because of the pain. And then I literally slept. And then when I woke up, it was 4 a.m. in the morning. I went downstairs to get water and went back to sleep. Even now, my hair is sore. But I guess that also has to do with the fact I haven't done my hair in a while. The last time I braided it, I think it might have been July. And it is now January. It's been quite a few months. But yeah. Also, my glasses are ready. So, I don't know. I'm going to get them, but they're ready. You guys should be ready to see my new glasses. These are the new specs. I chose these like lenses two weeks ago. They're blue. Hi vlog. I have not vlogged in a bit. I came back from my driving lesson like almost 30 minutes ago and I made myself a smoothie and some French toast for breakfast. I'll show you guys. There's my French toast and my smoothie. My smoothie has blueberries, strawberries, yoga and water. But now I need to do some university stuff because today registration opened for first year at Sunbosh. I'm going to work on my registration and then also my bursary applications. And then I also need to take a shower. After I've eaten them, because I'm currently working on this one bursary application. I'm also like, I was also midway into doing my registration, but I think I need my parents' help for that part. I mean, I'm currently home alone. But yeah. I feel like I look so much more brown, I think, because driving makes me like a tan on my face but yeah that's my plan for today to work on bursary and applications and my registration for film wash and then also film a bit for another video guess who is successfully finished with her registration it was basically no hicks no problems the first semester i have five modules and then second semester i have six I took a few minutes to consider when I would want to do the second, like the last module, like first semester, second semester, because at that point they were even. But now I've decided. But yeah, that is what is going on. I want to say something cringy, but I'm gonna stop myself from doing that. There's a lot going on in this chalet. Yeah. There's so much stuff in this mall in the car, but it's almost empty. So, it has been a few hours since I came back from the shop. Let me give you a rundown of my day, like yesterday and today. Yesterday I woke up, I had a driving lesson for an hour and a half from 11.30 till 1. And then after that we did the laundry and stuff. Then we went to game, not game, macro and McDonald's. And then we tried to go to Chinatown, it was closed. And today I woke up and then I had a driving lesson for two hours from half past nine. And then again, I took the laundry inside, got changed, and went with my dad to Osmond's. 
So in the past few days, I've gotten a lot of things for me for res, but then we still forget more tomorrow. I'm going to print things for res for decor and for the res like wall. But let me show you some of the things we have. Okay, so these are some of the things we got yesterday. This is not everything. If I'm right this is like a caddy like soaps and like things like hangers a lunchbox and let me take you guys downstairs i also got some cutlery and then inside this is a pan with plates and bowls and then cups and toothpicks but i'm not going to take it out because i want to break the plates and then this is basically everything we got at Osmond today like this broom bin and then like all these things like in here and this bucky and then this plastic and then these two so we got quite a bit of things it doesn't look like a lot but it is a lot because we also got other things like um things like laundry and washing dishes and like stationery and stuff like that but yeah i'll probably vlog again tomorrow when we go out to get things again also, once again, thank you to my parents. Without them, I wouldn't have any of these things. And I probably wouldn't have been able to go to this university without them. Like, they helped a lot, especially with, like, like paying for, like, tuition last year and now for university and stuff and, like, up, like things that I need. So, yeah, thank you to the parents. The things that happen when we come back from Chinatown. Like literally, she wanted these two egg spicy pulled duck noodles. Hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? They're nice. They're nice. What are you doing with milk? It's better than water. Are you gonna drink milk? Ew. No, how spicy this is. I'm also gonna try to see if Indy is a drama queen. I am. And it's not that spicy. I'm better at handling spice. I don't want to take a lot. Take a lot. Oh. Why is this? My chest is burning. It's like I went for a run. Ah! Girl, do you not know how to use your chopsticks? Okay, this is a lot. You have to eat the whole thing. It's not bad, but like... This one was like a little bit of What? I need water. Hi guys. It is the night before I do my drivers for my license tomorrow. I'm doing it. I go caught up as one. I'm not really nervous. Maybe I will be tomorrow, but I'm never nervous. I mentioned earlier, we went to Chinatown to get some things because there were some last minute things we needed to get. And if I forgot anything, we can get at a later stage. But yeah, so we got them up. I just lamps that works in low shading. I'm washing back in the house. Also, I've taken up my suitcase from the bathroom to remind myself to start packing tomorrow. Because I have tomorrow, which is Monday and Wednesday, and Monday, Monday and Tuesday to pack. And then I also have some clean clothes that went in the laundry over there and the bag of clean clothes that I think I'll definitely be packing. But let me show you what my room is looking like. It's looking up some mess. So there's a suitcase. There's some clothes on the table. And then another one in the corner you can't see. But it's all about figuring out which clothes I'm gonna take, which I'm gonna leave, and which shoes I'm gonna take, and which shoes I'm gonna leave. Also, the saddest thing happened to me yesterday. My earphones broke. Luckily, 
my headphones do work, but like they're like semi broken. But the thing is, with the headphones, they're kind of convenient because headphones you have to charge them. And earphones, sometimes you just want a wide earphone movement, you know. But yeah, I'm gonna watch YouTube, probably TikTok, so I can go to sleep and then wake up around 8 or 9 tomorrow morning. That's my plan. I'll, I'll see you before or after my driver's test or when I'm back. When I start packing, basically. Also, I don't know what shoes to take. Like, I know I'm definitely taking my Crocs, my Birkenstocks, my Birkenstocks, my shower shoes, and then my fake Birks I'm take, and then my New Balance, and my Uggs. And then I also have other shoes. I don't know. I don't know. Let me stop talking. Bye. See you later. So. I'm currently trying to get ready to leave the house because I have a lesson before my driver's test and I need to leave at quarter to 11, so I'm like 20 past 10. Why do I look like a munchkin in this outfit? I'm not going to wear these, I'm going to wear my Adidas, but I think I need to put a hoodie over this because this top is so oversized. And I was saying earlier, at some point, this top might turn into a pajama top, you know? Cause I hardly wear this, but I don't want to give it away because I like the boxy fit. But uh, I will need to wash my face, brush my teeth, and do my skincare and change my shoes. <sighs> yeah.